seems to uh, was speaking to me once after we'd crossed out a big TVA production because we had taken offense to something that was aired on there that in the end turned out to be not supposed to be taken offense to whatever, but we were, we were just in that mood to battle. So we smashed their piece and uh, ended up getting punched in the head a few times. It was all a thing. And um, seemed to have gone to New York during that time and came back to that time. And he had a, like a page signed, like a scene tag to Tyler. And he almost threw it with a bed and didn't want to give it to me after he'd heard what we had done. Cause he was like, you guys have the scene and it's like so well understood how it works. You guys get to see in the future because you get to see what happens in other scenes of, around the world, you know, just through magazines and books and conversations with writers. And you know what to do and not to do in order to maintain this good balance that we have and we've gone and done the wrong, gone down that negative, destructive path that might just keep just uh, cascading and just getting worse and worse. He was like super upset about it, but uh, then he said to me, what, just before he gave me the, the, the scene page, he asked me who asked you to do graffiti? And I said, no, he says, why do you do it? Because I wanted it. He's like, yeah, so I know why are you looking at other people for uh, gratification or like looking around? You just paint and you know, just do your thing. Paint on surfaces, that's all it is. Stop letting everybody know who you are and all this, like, you know, this whole thing becomes such a social scene and that's when it starts to disintegrate. Because most of the people, there's another thing that Solo once said is that most of, stop looking for friends within the graffiti scene because most of them were. Cook, you know, they don't dream. They're not, they don't fit into society. The paint of them and then leave them alone. Go have another friend who plays badminton or something. Like, go have some positive friends on the outside. Don't look for your best, tightest friendships or think of feeding because they're all kind of broken people. And we all are a little bit broken in our own way. And if we all cluster together, we break even further. You know what I mean? So you gotta have a little bit of balance there.